Hello friends, I am Prashant and welcome to this new vlog. And today in this vlog, I am going to make a portrait of Priyanka Chopra and I will show you practically in this video. So keep watching till the end, the video is gonna be very interesting. So friends, let's start and learn something new. If you are new in this channel, do not forget to press the bell icon and keep support the channel. So as you all know that I generally start with eyes, so I have started with eyes section and specifically I have made a video of these two eyes so you will get the link in my description box mainly specifically for this portrait I have made a tutorial how to make realistic eyes so as you can see I am drawing with art line and trying to making as realistic as possible I am leaving those spaces I am leaving the white spaces which will make it realistic look and uh, I'm using graphite as you can see I am trying to uh, blend as much as possible just to make a real stick and I am doing the eyebrows as well so hope uh, you will learn something so check my description box you will get the link so now we will move on uh, to the skin texture mainly as you know that for the skin texture I use I prefer 2B or HB and uh, blending is very much important as I always say so I am using a blending brush as well as cotton buds generally I use this bo uh, this two, two material actually as you can see I am just trying to uh, making the highlights make, trying to get the shades actually here is quite a dark shade so I am using 4B here mainly for the dark shade but blending is very much important whenever you are gonna draw any skin texture mainly for the hero heroines and any celebrity the skin texture needs to be smooth and that's why you have to blend it as even in the third layer as well so as you can see uh, when I'm gonna draw this uh, lips so the horizontal line is very much important you need to at least draw the horizontal line though I'm not following that uh, rule actually I'm just trying to make as realistic as possible you have to use a sharp pencil sharp pencils very much needed to do this kind of things uh, mainly this uh, sophisticated areas actually you need to use sharp pencil make your pencil sharp you can use mechanical pencil so friends as you can see I'm just moving towards the detailing uh, upon the lips as you can see the texture of the lips mainly in the upper lips and I have used Tombow mechanical eraser as well as I will also use a white uh, whitener or you can use a white gel pen as well to make a real stick so I have used as you can see as well as you have to use 4B or 6B to those lines within the lips and uh, I'm just trying to making the highlights making the dark areas as, as much as possible so uh, blending is very much important because you are making the texture of the skin so as I always say blending is much much important you need to practice that technique you need to make your art smooth so blending is very much important now we are moving towards the hair section and initially in the first layer I am using graphite as you can see then I will blend it first layer blend it then I will use charcoal again I will blend it as you can see I am using Camlin soft charcoal but main thing is you need to blend it even after the second and the third layer you need to blend in maybe in the fourth layer you may not allow to blend much so as you can see I am just trying to leaving those white spaces just to getting the highlights and uh, to look realistic so as you can see in the same way I am just uh, trying to make this uh, here this sides here actually even here uh, I so friends now we are moving towards the dress as you can see this section will be much dark and that's why I am directly using charcoal but with soft medium hard I am using three mediums of charcoal but you need to blend it as you know that charcoal is uh, such a medium where blending is very easy actually 
so you can blend the charcoal medium very easily even rather than graphite as well as you can see if you blend it the texture will very smooth so this is very much important but within the trays even within that uh, much of darkness you have to observe where the light is coming where the highlights where the dark shadow will fall over so these are the points you need to note down you need to observe mainly as you can see some of the areas are not much dark and i'm just trying to leave those spaces i'm using kneadable eraser to get some of the highlights even within the skin uh, kneadable eraser is very effective for the skin as well as for this kind of highlights mainly in the clothes so in the same way i will uh, make this sides dress as you can see i'm using three charcoal hard medium soft and three charcoal pencil are available in camlin uh, so but blending is very important whatever the layer you are drawing blending is very much important whenever you will use charcoal mainly so as you can see again i am just trying to blend it and trying to making a such a realistic look with these shades and i am using tombow to get the highlights within the hairs actually so this way you can draw and hope the result will be good if the video is interesting do not forget to share and support the channel hope the other tutorials which uh, those are on the way will be very much interesting keep watching keep supporting the channel for so many tutorial videos and as you can see these earrings actually we have to make it realistic so this is way, this is the way you can complete hope the video was very interesting keep supporting keep watching thank you